friends welcome to seek show youtube channel hope you are doing well with seek show agis tutorials and there are other videos in my playlist the seek show go to seek show youtube channel home page and check for the videos available for you you can learn something new from my videos and today i'm going to show you a video related to ArcGIS so I'm going to convert this line shape file into KML files if you are an ArcGIS lover this video is for you let's go to the lesson but before that please remember to subscribe for my channel and click the bell button to get the latest video updates to you Okay, right. Uh, search in the search in the search bar here. You can search for this tool layer to KML conversion. The tool is located under the conversion tools. By clicking here, you can go to the location here under the conversion tools to KML layer to KML. This is the tool. You can double click here to get to open the tool by double clicking you can open the tool and add the layer file and you can convert into a layer uh, convert it into a KML file here you can add your line these are the separate lines which I have located under the table of contents for now if you are a polygon you can add your polygon here after adding you can set your output location for now I will select desktop I will select this folder 123 folder you can give a name right this is the easy method to give a name just click copy and paste in your output folder and save as type must be kmz or, or kml both are same it doesn't matter now it's time to click OK now I am going to convert this particular line line shape file into a KML file still I'm not discussing about the batch processing so I'm showing I have showed that how to convert shape file or a line shape file into a KML file by using a particular tool so in this method if we are going to convert all these line shape files we have to do the same process for several times right here you can see still the process is ongoing right go to GA processing and go to results where you can see whether the process is ongoing or the process is completed right let's wait for the output i'm again telling that you can use batch processing to reduce your time of processing the files right for now i have showed convert shape file into a kml file still the process is ongoing we have applied the tool only for this vertical line but we have several number of files to be processed to be converted into a kml file so in this method Oh, we got the output now you can see the output I'm going to my fold output folder double click and you can see this KML file by double clicking this you can open this through the Google Earth okay this is the first output right you can see the a single line here I'm going to untick all the other things you can go to properties and give it a remarkable color click OK and which should be number two one point two point five click OK now you can see the converted KML file file using the Google Earth okay let's go for the batch processing I will have to apply this same tool for several times if I am going to do the 
the same thing but we can go for the batch processing of the layer to KML tool right click and go to batch right here is the window you can see the process of doing it right please carefully watch the way I am doing it right so those are the files I need to convert into a KML file you have to add rows by using that plus mark I hope you can understand what I am doing now. Previously we applied this tool for a single file, right? Just for but this but this time we open this tool in a batch mode. That means we can add a batch file, batch more than uh, one file, right? One by one you have to add the shape files. Just copy the name that you want, paste it here, save, click OK and then the next file, next save file that you want to convert it, convert into a KML file, give separate names that belongs to those save files, save and OK here. Likewise, we have to add all the shape files that you need to convert into a KML file in a single click, right? I'm going to fast forward this one. Click OK. Right. I have filled all the details and then you can just click OK. Then it will automatically give us the output that means we will receive all the other KML files in the output folder. You can see by looking at the results still the process is ongoing. I have okay oh already two KML files are here. This is my output folder I am in my output folder new KML files are creating for now so in this method you can easily convert different shape files into a KML file in a single click if you have many number of shape files that need to be converted into a KML file right so the process is okay for now you can see the outputs here all the files have been converted by using batch mode in a single click right you can open these KML files using uh, Google Earth and uh, that's all for today hope you learned something new if you like this video please hit a like and if you have anything to ask please comment in the comment section you can check the description section below for more videos related to batch processing and hope you stick with my channel by subscribing my the seek show channel i will be back with a new lesson soon till then take care and goodbye